wish you a very happy 2022 and a wonderful new year to all of you and welcome to the next open day in a series of open days in masa and this year and this open day we decided to have a vod as well where we can actually talk to you and this is me sri uh, director for research and postgraduate studies and i'm going to talk to you today about this important question is it worth doing a phd now this is a question that probably plagues every research student at some point or the other in the in in your careers uh a phd is a huge undertaking emotionally mentally financially and it takes 3 to 4 years to complete and in some universities it may take even 6 um, 5 to 6 universities uh, in years to complete but the decision for you to pursue a phd after you get your masters degree it's a very easy decision now i'm not here to sell you anything from masa university i'm not here to sell you any program but all i can say is uh, my experience at masa we offer a progression from masters to phd where you can actually pursue your same research topic that you did in your masters and you can add some additional uh, uh, parameters and go on to progress in your thesis area now if you don't know we have a quite a few masters program in healthcare we have a master of science in anatomy a master of science in public health master of science mix mode which is both research and uh, um, uh, education mode masters in pharmacy masters in physiotherapy now any of these candidates when you finish your masters and if you have a good standing you are eligible to go on and do your phd in research phd in nursing also phd in pharmacy and now this year 2022 we have two new phd programs phd in uh, business and phd in engineering now in business the mba programs will lead on to the corresponding phd so our programs in masa actually give you the ability to make sure that you sort of stay motivated throughout the time when your experiments are being done and that means also while writing your thesis actually so we offer you opportunities to apply for grants for funds from national and international bodies we connect you with supervisors who would apply for frgs funds for you and at all times of your 3 years or 4 years or 5 years you will continue to do the same research that you have been doing for uh, your masters for example if you have been working on say Uh, let me give you an example in pathology and medicine which is my field we've been working on uh, tumor markers bcl2 in, in colorectal tumors you can go on and do an immunohistochemistry in cmake and p53 in colorectal tumors as well using the same clinical material but additional immunology immunological parameters or fish fluorescent in, in, in situ uh, hybridization so all these you can actually do as an extension of your masters again i go back to the question would you want to pursue a career in phd now people pursue phd for many reasons for some they want to start their own labs at universities some have a pressure that they want to go to the top field in the university a top degree in the field some feel it is a natural progression after your masters and some like me we continue in academia we just don't know what to do next so we feel that okay academia is what's for us for many you need a phd for a promotion and so on but i tell you it is a personal decision but this is something that you shouldn't take lightly we have a we have a diverse range of faculties in masa we offer courses in dentistry medicine health sciences pharmacy and so to further your studies from masters to phd in highly specialized fields within these fields that i've told you uh, is not just maybe a logical choice but um, uh, it's an achievable one and we have reasonable fee structures as well so who are you going to choose as your supervisor guys a good phd supervisor is worth their weight in gold and finding a supervisor is a priority for many students 
And that's where we offer high class supervisors to whom you will be uh, committing your topic and your work for three to four years. You would be under the mentorship of the supervisor. And not just the supervisor, you have to be passionate about your research topic. And uh, our program that we offer is rightly structured just to make sure that your passions are kindled. That's the best word. And we'll make sure that you work on something that you care about. We won't trust any other work, uh, any other um, PhD topics that we feel isn't your forte. That will not be compelled to you. OK, so with this in mind, uh, uh, I hope you guys uh, take a right decision on whether to join PhD or not. And if so, you guys can decide on uh, what topic to choose and what supervisor to choose and what university to choose. And when it comes to the question of what university to choose, as I said, MASA offers you um, some of the best supervisors. We have over 60 trained supervisors and uh, uh, good research facilities and opportunities for you to apply for national grants and international grants. And um, above everything, uh, you have a chance to progress from your master's to PhD without searching for any other universities. Now, there are many students who, after doing their master's, have to apply in other places for PhDs. But in our case, uh, when you feel that you want to continue with the same work under the same supervisor and in the same topic with more advanced parameters, uh, this is the best place for you. And we insist that all our students publish their research work in ISI and Scopus papers. So we are also making sure that uh, you develop your CVs while you apply for um, career opportunities and job prospects um, world over. So welcome to Masa, guys, and um, have a good time with your education here. If you have any doubts at any time, feel free to uh, call me or any members in my team. We're always ready to help you. And happy hunting for a suitable course, a suitable degree, and a suitable subject of your choice. Thank you once again.